in the country. The Chadar Institute of Bankers of Nigeria has reassured Nigerians that the planned bank recapitalization exercise would boost the nation's gross domestic product. President of the Institute, Professor Pius Olari Waju, stated this uh, in an event for new members uh, where he also called for excellence in banking operations towards efficiency and customer satisfaction of the nation's financial system. CIBN president said that the recapitalization of banks which had begun would strengthen Nigeria's banking sector, increase banks' uh, lending capacity, and improve overall resilience of the financial system. There is no doubt the fact that today we have some economic challenges. The rate of inflation is very high. The uh, GDP is somehow low. But we thank God that as from this month, things have started improving. And we are coming out, if you look at exactly the speech made by the, uh, by the professor, he did mention that there is hope for tomorrow. And as bankers, we play a very pivotal role in the economy, you know, because uh, the, every economy needs financial intermediation. That is mobilizing funds from the uh, surplus units and using those funds for those people who have capable and viable projects in the deficit units. What can banks do to drive this growth agenda? And we are saying our submission is that uh, you know, banks essentially play the role of intermediation. For the Central Bank of Nigeria, they need to be able to align you know, their monetary policies with those of the fiscal arm of government. That alignment is very key, okay? And then creating institutions, and then banks playing their role in terms of intermediation, you know, making sure resources are made available for implementation of all the strategic initiatives. The significance that provides the platform, a networking platform for, the, for bankers, for top-notch bankers, for our stakeholders and it's an annual event like I've said. It gives us an opportunity to discuss topical issues and also to provide solutions to national economic aid. Securities market fell slightly today as investors brace for data packed week, cumulating 